How's it going everybody? Max here coming to you from New York City. In this latest update, I want to share the news with you guys that your age is incorrect. That's right. You're not as old as you think you are. Or maybe you're older. Well, let me clarify. You actually have two ages. One is your chronological age, which is fixed and determined by your birth year. The second is your biological age, and that's something else entirely. Let me explain. Recently, scientists looked at a group of 26-year-olds. Not 26-year-olds, but people that were aged 26, and follow them across 12 years longitudinally. And over the course of those 12 years, looked at various biomarkers, which are metrics that can be measured in a lab setting, like cholesterol, inflammation, things like that. And what they found was that over the course of those 12 years, even though they all aged 12 years chronologically speaking, biologically their ages were much different. Most subjects aged one year biologically, again, looking at their biomarkers for every one chronological year that passed. That makes sense. But some of them actually aged zero years for every chronological year that passed, showing, in effect, that those people actually were aging at a slower rate. Some of the subjects aged as much as three years for every one chronological year that passed. Now, one very interesting thing about this study is that they also looked at physical appearance, and what they found was that in accordance with their biological age, physical appearance was highly correlated which means that for those subjects that appeared to be aging slower, they also looked younger than their peers. Now, this is absolutely incredible. So you may be asking yourselves, how can I slow down my rate of biological aging? Well, there are some things that you can do to make sure that your telomeres stay long and healthy. Now, you've heard me talk about telomeres in the past. Telomeres are sort of like the shoelace caps uh, at the end of your chromosomes that maintain their integrity as you age, and they invariably get shorter with age, but there are various things that you can do to make sure that uh, they stay long and healthy as you age. Making sure that your vitamin D levels are optimal uh, can definitely protect telomere length, and meditation has been shown to actually lengthen your telomeres. Meditation is obviously uh, incredibly beneficial, and people have been practicing it for eons, but science is now really sort of uh, converging with the wisdom of the ages to show that meditation really has profound effects on your biology. Ensuring that you're getting adequate magnesium. Many people do not get adequate magnesium, especially in the United States, uh, and yet it's so easy to. Magnesium is at the center of the chlorophyll molecule, and so by consuming dark leafy greens or various seeds, pumpkin seeds are an incredible source of magnesium, you can make sure that your body is repairing your DNA damage um, as you age. Now, this is incredibly exciting research, very empowering, because we tend to think of our ages as fixed, but in reality, our biological age, as measured by you know, what's actually going on underneath the surface can be vastly different from our chronological age. Keep that in mind, make sure you're eating your dark leafy greens, exercise, take vitamin D, and make sure that your omega-3 levels are optimal before shelling out your hard-earned cash for that overpriced uh, anti-aging cream. Anyway, I hope this was useful for you. If you find these videos interesting, subscribe to me on YouTube, follow me on Facebook, on Twitter, I'm at Max Lugavere, and Instagram, at Max Lugavere. I will see you next time. Peace.